want to address uh, three issues. Number one, uh, there is a systematic attempt by the national governments uh, to claw back on devolution, especially on matters healthcare. When you look at the framers of the Constitution, uh, healthcare is a devolved function. But when you look at what the national government is doing through the Ministry of Health, it is now engaging the union officials of the ministry. They now want to engage the community health uh, volunteers, now called community health promoters, directly. And yet, primary health care is a devolved function. The national treasury is also engaging, or rather the national government, is also engaging directly our development partners when it comes to conditional grants that are supposed to go and promote health care. This, in our view, as the 47 governors, is an attempt to grow back our devolution, and we are requesting the national government at least to appreciate the fact that the devolved functions must be supported. When you have development partners coming on board uh, through conditional grants, let those grants go directly uh, to the county governments. I know the president pronounced himself that this is a function which is very committed to ensure that all those devolved functions are actually devolved. And that's why as the 47 governors, we are asking the national government to expedite the process of unbundling, the costing, the transfer of functions and also resources. Because we need to have financial discipline where resources <laughs> Now the full screen as we welcome our moderate of the session. Many are quiet because they are ashamed of it, but it's a big problem. The other person as well. Right, you. CPA, thank you. CPA, Alex Challenge, ready to. We cannot be politicians. Why can't we take these actions that account us? A big round of applause to Friday, too, to all of you who have cared of Sante Sana. Ladies and gentlemen,